Well, that's easy. Sanderson sisters from Hocus Pocus. Yeah, but which one? All three, what do you mean which one? No, 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 come on, you can't choose all three. They're all hot for very different reasons, don't make me choose. Okay, Michael, which fictional character turned you on as a kid? Okay, paws down, Nala from The Lion King. No, because she got that Tom Cub thing going, and then she turns into the sleek, sexy huntress. And then there's that scene, the scene in uh, Grass where she gives the look, you know, the look, but she's like. What about you, Bevan? Oh, that's easy. Yosemite Sam, hands down. No, I like it because there's something kind of sexy about a guy with, like, can't see anything but his eyes and his nose and a bunch of facial hair. How about you, handsome? What? Which one would you choose? Oh, uh, what Bevan said. <laughs> oh. Oh, crap. I should probably go. I've been forced to interview some nerd tomorrow about his app. Yeah, I should get going, too. Got my internship. OK. Bye, guys. Take it easy, Eric. Oh, yeah. Take it easy, guys. More Ryan Gosling beach pictures online. Oh, God. What is he doing? Uh, is he, like, like splashing someone? <laughs> I mean, like, I'm into water sports, but it's not Wednesday, so. Hey, hey. Hey, girl. Oh, Bevan, did you have an interview today? Yeah, why? Yeah, he's sitting over there. He's here already? Crap. I thought I was gonna have time to look at the Gosling pictures. Right. Uh, he's 20 minutes early. Did he seem upset? No, I can't see him. Great. Well, I might as well get this over with. Blessings, my child. Hi, I'm so sorry I'm late. I had to grab my... Good morning. I'm Kent. You must be Bevan. Him? Great. Uh, just this way. Yeah. Michael, I need you to help me with something for a minute. Okay, does it involve algebra? Because the moment the alphabet gets involved, I'm kind of out. No. I need you to help me with something over there. In the studio? In the studio, yeah. So, Kent, uh, you got a last name? It's Clark. Hey, Kent Clark. Hmm. Hmm. Your parents named you Ken Clark? Yeah. My parents were comic book nerds, so they thought it would be funny. Yeah. Comic book nerds, huh? You're not into comics? No, I mean, it's not really for me, you know? It's not really um, my thing. It's a great Batman socks, by the way. What? Oh, I'm... Batman, I mean, he's, he's more of a way of life than a comic book, so, yeah. <clears throat> Kent, tell me about this app of yours. So, what it does is it tracks your activity on social media. For every action that you take, whether it's uh, commenting or tweeting or posting a photo, you get points. And you can change those points into dollars that you can donate to your favorite charity. Uh... And you um, bought this company for um, your own financial gain? Oh, no. I, I, donating to charities and helping kids in need has always been a passion of mine. Do you like pink? Poison Ivy. Are you serious? Oh. You think poison ivy is the table. craziest female? One of the legs has gone a bit wobbly, so what I need you to do is go yeah, under there and screw it back on from the bottom. I don't know, that sounds pretty complicated. It's literally the easiest thing I could have asked you to do. A child with no hands or feet could do it. It's really sad imagery. Just Why not? Go. She has the ability to control every plant organism in the city. Instead of using it to help the world, she uses it as a weapon for her vendetta against the guy that dresses up like a bat. Yeah, that doesn't make her crazy. That just makes her a determined, growth-minded individual. Ugh. All right, so what do you do? Easy, Harley Quinn. 
Oh, you would. What's wrong with Harley Quinn? It's the most obvious choice. It's the most obvious choice because she is crazy. She was literally driven insane by the Joker. She's psychotic. She fell in love with an asshole psycho that treated her like shit. That's not psychotic. Oh, jeez. What the fuck? Um, uh, you, what about you? Goofy intern. Who would, who would you pick? Me? Yeah, you. Who in the Batman universe out of the females do you think is the craziest? Uh, I don't know. Great use of our time. Right. Right. Barbara, Barbara hey, Gordon. Batgirl, Barbara Gordon. That's not a villain, but... Yeah, no, 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 that's the point. Okay, it's not the villains in Gotham that are crazy. It's the heroes. I mean, the villains are kind of justified. I mean, dipped in crazy chemicals, crazy boyfriend that drives them even crazier, uh, mind manipulation. They have their reasons. What reason does Barbara Gordon have to go into the streets of Gotham and fight crime at night? She comes from an upper middle class family. She has Jim Gordon as her dad, who has the most lawful mustache since Tom Selleck. I think he'd be a good dad, particularly if it's Gary Oldman and not Ben McKenzie. What's wrong with her mind that would make her do this? Uh, she has a genius IQ. She has a body that is active and she's constantly doing stuff. She just goes out in the street of Gotham, kicks ass and takes names until she can no longer kick because she's been shot in the spine by the Joker. And you think that would stop her, right? Wrong, man. She goes to the computer and she's like, I'm gonna be your Google, Batman and Robin. I'm gonna solve things through the power of the internet. And you know what? That is crazy because she had no reason in the first place. Plus, she's a ginger, and gingers be cray. Sit down. Hey. Sit down. I bet. Wow, that's, that's, that's wow. I mean, you don't hear about entrepreneurs doing stuff like that nowadays. It's, wow. Uh. Yeah. <laughs> Well, I, um, ah, uh, no, I think that, I think that's it. I think we are good. Yeah. I, I think it's going to be a really great piece. Thank you so much for coming in. Yeah, I think it's going to be great too. And it's been so fun talking to you. I, I. Yeah. Oh, 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 yeah. Oh, sure. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Great. Uh, I should. Oh, yeah. Sure. Can I get your number? Oh, sure. Sorry. It's uh, 3 30. No, I meant your number. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Of course. I, I, I don't understand the question. Raindrops are better than bird shit Any freaking day of the week My quirky nerdiness is finally paying my bills Overjoyed and elated, I could puke on the street Give all my...